Yes, definitely yes. The Fujifilm X4 Nord 6 is good for portraits. I mean, it's great. I had this camera for a month now and I've been loving it so far. Been enjoying it with every time I shoot with it. It's magical. And yeah, I'm gonna tell you why. I think one of the obvious upgrades from the last iteration of this camera is the new 40 meg megapixel image sensor and it's fixed um, 23mm um, f2 lens. The X106 captures images with an impressive level of detail, meaning from that 40 megapixels that you get, you get more details and then gives you more freedom of cropping. So it's good for um, prints and also for like um, yeah, just pictures generally. And let's talk about that fixed 23 mil lens equivalent to 35 mil in full frame. It's perfect for environmental portraits and it's one of my favorite uh, focal lengths that I use in like weddings and engagement and portraits. And from that f2.0 aperture, you can still get that beautiful stunning bokeh or um, background separation so yeah however i think the real game changer of this camera is its exceptional eye and face autofocus and tracking um, this feature ensures your subject remains in sharp focus whenever or no matter how dynamic the setting is 90 percent of the time like i shoot in like afc mode and i love how sticky the tracking of this camera or the autofocus of this little guy so I've been enjoying that pretty much one more feature that I love with this camera are the film simulation modes or using those uh, Fuji film recipes that they call so basically it's like a preset in camera so you don't have to remove your SD card or take a picture and then remove your SD card and put it to your um, computer and then edit in Lightroom. It's just when you take a picture, JPEGs will come out like really good and already edited with your um, recipes that you you put into the camera. So yeah, I really love that because it's like you can take a photo and then upload it to Instagram or Facebook right away. So no more editing or other stuff. So one little downside of this camera for me is the LCD screen. So it's, I find it like it's not high res enough, like comparing with other um, cameras like the Sony a7 IV. Um, the Sony a7 IV screen is really good. Like you can see the details, colors is like consistent when you open up in the computer. While the X106, it's sometimes like hit or miss. So. I don't know but it's not a big deal for me but but I hope um, Fuji will like upgrade the LCD screen on this um, the next iteration of this camera or model so yeah fingers crossed so that's it for this video I will leave you more portraits and photos that I took since I had this camera so yeah please like comment and share if you haven't please subscribe and yeah thank you See you in the next video. Bye.